Hi guys, the Metal Maniac back again, and welcome to another music collection update. Um, so let's just get into it. So, first off is the compilation album Evil Metal by the band Vuer, or Var, I really don't know how to pronounce this. Um, this is a um, French-Canadian band, and I'm pretty sure uh, this is either not English at all, or is pronounced with a certain accent that I don't know how to pronounce it with. Anyway, uh, you know, the uh, title right here. Or not the title, the uh, name of the band. Um, yeah, but yeah, just a pretty interesting, uh, kind of underrated and overlooked um, uh, French-Canadian thrash metal band. <clears throat> All right. Next up is my first picture, uh, vinyl picture disc, uh, and that is um, the album uh, Beneath Grow Lights Thou Shalt Rise by Cannabis Corpse. Um, yeah, this is sort of um, a parody, uh, a death metal parody band. Um, kind of in a way to Death Clock, how Death Clock was a parody of death, uh, a band that was a parody of death metal. Uh, this is kind of like that as well. But maybe even a little bit more of a parody than even uh, Death Clock. Um, uh, yeah, I just actually recently discovered this band like a few days ago. Um, and uh, even the title of the uh, band is a parody of Cannibal Corpse. Uh, of course, Cannibal Corpse. Cannabis Corpse. Um, and uh, even their song titles are parodies as well. Also, something that's pretty weird but pretty funny is at the same time is that not only are there song titles and, um, song titles and album titles, uh, parodies of, uh, um, titles of different iconic death metal, uh, albums and song titles, but for some reason, every single song is not only that, but at the same time, like, a play on words of, like, anything to do with, like, smoking weed and shit, I don't know why, but, uh, yeah, I just found that pretty funny, how it's just a parody of a parody of a parody, and uh, even though they sound legit, you know, they sound pretty much like an actual death metal band, everything else around them, like the imagery, the uh, lyrics, and song titles are all parody of different stuff. Um, I found that to be uh, pretty funny. Uh, and the music is also really good as well. Um, <clears throat> next up is a live album. Uh, the Seventh Date of Hell, live at Hammersmith Odeon, 1984, by the band Venom. Um, now, this this version of this album, I don't think, came out until relatively recently, I believe. Uh, I think, wait, uh, the year before last year, I think. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, 2020, so it was the year before last year. Um, originally, this was only on VHS tape. There was a video of, of the uh, live show, originally. And then, uh, for the longest time, there wasn't any actual, like, actual live album. Uh, but, you know, uh, 2020, they finally released it as a live album. Uh, although they did cut a song off for some reason. Uh, Blood, the song Bloodlust is supposed to be on here, but it's not. Um, and then there's a song that's actually on here, I can't remember which one it was, but it's not on the actual track listing on the back, for some reason. Um, but, uh, anyway... Uh, I am going to do this, uh, a, a review of this pretty soon, um, probably within the next couple of days, um, but I, I have already listened to it, so, um, I already know my thoughts on it. <clears throat> and then finally, the big one, the one that I've been waiting for to arrive in the mail for a while now, another Venom-related thing, and that's this amazing box set, um, what is it called? Uh, 40 Years in Sodom. Um, I have a similar... I already had a similar thing, which was a compilation album, which I believe... Was it called that, or was it called In Nominee Satanus? I don't remember. Um, but it had a similar uh, cover to this... Uh, cover of this box set. Um, this box set uh, has all four... Oh, sorry. All first of their four... Their first four albums, all of those. Um, it has, I think, one live album... Uh, let's see, what else is on here? Hold on, I went through this already, but, hold on, I, uh, ah. Uh, all four of their first albums, 
uh, a live album, a compilation of their early demos, a book, and um, and an EP, not an EP, a single, the Bloodlust single, but it's like a picture disc, um, as well as a bunch of bonus posters and stuff as well. Um, but, uh, yeah, I can't wait to review this box set, although I will review the individual albums, uh, individual, and in, uh, I will, why am I messing up my words today? I will re review the individual albums in, the, in individual videos, uh, but as, as a whole, I will, re I will do sort of like a unboxing slash review of this entire box set as a whole, um, as well, but, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Anyway, so that's about it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all next time.